best places to visit in Abra Province Abra Province in the Philippines had long been an unexplored region. Many of this province's tourist attractions are now being discovered by visitors. Because it is in North Luzon, Abra is frequently overlooked. Ilocos in the west and the Cordilleras in the east are two of the most well-known tourist sites nearby. You'll see a combination of both in Abra. Along with breathtaking mountain views and hill tribe traditions, you can locate Spanish colonial heritage sites and Ilocano culture. Check out this list of the best places to go and things to do in the Philippines if you're searching for a destination that's on the rise. Don Mariano Marcos Bridge is the longest bridge in the province of Abra and third longest bridge in the Philippines. Located at Abra Kalinga National Road, the bridge was completed in 1974 and was named after the father of President Marcos Sr., Don Mariano Marcos. According to the locals you can sing the entire Philippine national anthem, Lupang Hinarang while passing over the bridge. San Quentin, the 40-meter tunnel at Tangata, San Quentin, was constructed in 1934 and took two years to complete. During World War II, the Allied forces made two attempts to demolish the tunnel in order to block the Japanese soldiers' advance. The tunnel, often called Yusuken, is a well-known site in the Provinciopening of the Abra Pasalubong Center in San Quentin, close to the Tangadan Tunnel. Coffee, cacao de belay, woven goods, bamboo products, furniture, and processed food, as well as to give our fellow Abrenos employment possibilities and money. Teofilo Garcia, who was recognized as a national living treasure, is the final survivor of the gourd hat manufacturers, from the seeds to the hats varnishing. He wants to continue the practice by passing on the necessary information and abilities. The simplest waterfall to access in the province of Abra, in my opinion, is Pantok Falls. Without realizing it, hundreds or perhaps thousands of people walk by it every day within 350 meters. Tayam the 300-year-old ancestral home of the Cario family is now the Gabriela Cario Salang Gallery of Fine Arts, and Aladdin's cave filled with precious relics. After her husband Diego Salang was put to death, the revolutionary Gabriela Salang fled to this home to avoid being captured by Spanish soldiers. The Spanish-era Baroque Santa Catalina de Alejandria Church is located in Tayam, Abra. In 2001, the Philippines designated it as a national cultural treasure. Sal Lapadan, the first Tinguian community established in the highlands of Abra under the American government was called Sal Lapadan. The barrio where the first administrative center was located gave the municipality its name. The name of a wild bush that dominated the area at the time and was given to the village by its first occupants was, Sahipa Chan. Dear campers, experience, glamorous camping, with live music, movies, cold nights, cuisine, bonfire, and the opportunity to make new friends. Come to camp if you want to unwind, take in live music, see movies on a huge screen, Go on a gastronomic adventure, relax, and shout your Balang Ara. Langidan, Mount Bulagao, a prominent landmark that can be seen from Bangwood and other areas of Abra and Ilocos Sur, is the first of these possibilities now that the peace and order situation has somewhat improved. This mountain is also known to locals as the Sleeping Beauty because, like Makiling and other mountains, it is shaped like a maiden lying down. It is situated in Langadan town, about two hours from Bangla. Balini, Bani, Balini, Abra is the location of Balini Bani Hot Spring. 
After 32 kilometers of dirt road, it is accessible via jeepney. Swimmers who enjoy taking baths in both hot and cold water will find this place to be ideal. A winding road cruise along and between mountain ranges, in addition to the area's hot spring, provides a dramatic mountain trip experience. La Paz, Loom Webbing Village. The craft of loom weaving has been passed down through the generations in the province of Abra. Each family is kept alive by it as a means of nutrition for daily life. The group is also connected by a memento from great-grandparents and other forebears. The loom weaving page BRGY. Bulgilala La Paz, Abra, where you may observe the loom weavers INABEL work and the results of their labor. Danglas, Nagaparan, Danglas, Abra's diminutive Baguio, Alocos Norte Abra Road The Damascus View Deck, Park for Meditation and Introspection, Trail Running and Mountain Biking Park, Campsite at the Highest Point, Philippine Watch Point for the Serpent Eagle, 100 Year Old Tree, Park of Solidarity, One and Only. Lagayan a beautifully landscaped resort, Lujuic Spring is a great place to go on picnics and spend time with loved ones. Its clean water is very enticing for a swim, making it the ideal place to cool off from the summer heat. The pools surrounding trees' subsurface reservoirs supply the water. It's incredible to learn that the locals in the region used this water for drinking and culinary purposes. The climb to Ar Arbus Falls is one of many exciting activities in Abra. Along the route, there is so much to see and discover. The Palsaguan River is the main source of local unusual fish, including the Ludong, Kampa, Agat, Baladao, and Econ, as well as freshwater shrimp that are as large as tiger prawns. Along the river, you may find bamboo traps called Bukata that are spaced apart and secured in place by hefty rock. Loganjalang, in Barangay Bakoa, Loganjalang, Abra, try an adventure at the Galangugong River. It was a pleasant experience swimming in a river with green water surrounded by mountains, with some kind men from the Barangay. They deserve special thanks for coming with us and for the bamboo rafting adventure. Bukai, the Layugan Garden in this town, which receives an average of 300 visitors each day, is the newest attraction in the province. It is attractive both during the day and at night when lit thanks to its 10,000 artificial tulips in vibrant colors. Tulip LED flowers in various colors, including red, yellow, pink, white, and blue, are skillfully arranged on an elevated land. Luba, the river divides many of the settlements in Abra. As a result, the inhabitants are used to traveling through the area on rafts. However, the area is not always secure, particularly when a high tide or impending rain is present. As a result, a footbridge was constructed so that people could pass through the area if crossing the river became too dangerous. That's not all, though. This hanging footbridge is one of the longest in the nation, measuring at least 580 meters. San Isidro, in the Philippine province of Abra, San Isidro, officially known as the municipality of San Isidro, is a fifth-class municipality. 4,745 people call it home according to the 2020 census. Tigalay Falls, San Isidro, Abra. When you see what you never believed were gorgeous falls in person, you'll be abramazing with happiness. The travel time to Bangwood, Abra, is only 30 minutes. Bangwood. Bangid, officially the municipality of Bangid, 
is a first-class municipality and capital of the province of Abra, Philippines. According to the 2020 census, it has a population of 50,382 people. The provincial capital is where a journey to Abra begins. To enjoy a bird's-eye perspective of the Abra Plains, powerful rivers, and mountain peaks, visit Victoria Park's panoramic platform at Casamata Hill National Park. The Cathedral of St. James the Greater, Bangwood Church, and San Lorenzo Ruiz Shrine are two historic locations in the city cemetery chapel. Tubo. In the municipality of Tubo, Abra in the northern Philippines, Kili Village is a small outlying community. The trip from Tubo to Kili requires two crossings of the Abra River, a change of jeepney, a havel havel or tricycle, and travel on a seemingly endless road. The trek is worthwhile because once you reach Kili, you will enjoy the genuine hospitality of the Mang tribe. The falls are a very potent work of nature. The route is not yet completely paved, but the view is excellent, crossing high above rivers and rice fields below. Sit on the smooth-faced rocks and watch the water's fury as it pours over the sheer cliff face in awe. Despite not being particularly tall, Keeley Falls produces a significant amount of spray, which enhances the atmosphere. Its waters are clear and calm, and you can swim there and explore the tiny cave on the right side of the basin. Perhaps some anglers will visit the river to fish, which will provide a good opportunity for pictures. Tinape, another mysterious location near Tinape, Abra, is a pow rolling hills. Enjoy a beautiful view of the mountains with dry grassland on top from the vantage point across the high valley. It is most beautiful at sunset, when the mountainsides burst into a stunning crimson hue. One of the largest and longest rivers in Abra is the Tinate River. Basically, there aren't any commercial tour companies, travel destinations, or amenities that involve the Tinate River, as of this writing, but it's ready to provide you with anything from mild water activities to intense ones. Further down the road from a pow rolling hills is where you may see this natural beauty. Shiny white limestone rock formations that line the banks of the Tinig River are the area's highlights. The top tourist destination in Tinig is Kaparkan Fall. Likwan Bay. Located in Bay Likwan, Abra, in the heart of the Cordillera mountain ranges, is the wild and wonderful campsite. Experience nature at its most beautiful. New tourist destination. Discover the best of nature. The country road inside the rancho is a very attractive and soothing atmosphere indeed. Camping, hiking, and sightseeing are all parts of this wild and magnificent location to explore and be one with nature. A road, a tree, and or the outdoors may be depicted. Formations of Baluyan Lion Rock This stunning natural feature is located in Likwan Bay, Abra. The world is home to many different kinds of rock formations, so keep that in mind. Try to visit the location after the epidemic if you're new to exploration. San Juan. The municipalities that make up Abra include San Juan. San Juan enjoys a paradisiacal natural setting. A most rural village where the morning news extols the wonders of nature. Cheap meal. Visit San Yuan, Little Corn, Palawan, and experience the chilly river. There is something in Camp Roscoe for everyone, whether you desire a peaceful camping trip, an exhilarating ATV ride, enjoyable kayaking, or breathtaking views of the surrounding area. 
Which locations have you added to your travel wish list? Have you visited any stunning locations in Avra that ought to be on our list? Please feel free to express your ideas. If you like this video please leave a comment down below. Subscribe to this channel and let us do this together. Don't forget to click the notification bell for more updates. Thank you guys for watching.